When you've got good friends, they... Hello, uh, 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 welcome back to the uh, Jeff Show. Do you do you know what this is? A lot of people always ask me what this is, and it is a product review show. And a lot of people say, okay, but when do you do it? And we make sure to do it every single day of the year. So that's an interesting piece of trivia. And then they say, but when do you, when do, you do it? With an eye contact like what I just said was not exactly true. And then I say we only do it on Mondays. And we have a funny laugh and maybe some tea. And I've got a new friend. And that's how all of my friendships start. Today is Monday, November 25th. And I am here, um, as always, with... Uh, a good friend, and um, and he is um, he is an increasingly bad co-host, and his name is Peter. So it has been a fascinating week, and I think you all know exactly what I'm talking about. If you uh, love the show, please go ahead and smash that subscribe button and those like buttons, and always comment about every single thing you see on the show because the internet is a talking. <laughs> <laughs> and uh, and and what they're talking about is the model we had on the show last week, Anna. Uh, Anna was somebody that everybody loved and everybody wanted to see on the show. There were even some comments of people saying that this is now this now should be called the Anna Sh- Anna Show, uh, which hurt my feelings a little bit. But I can understand why she was charismatic, she was wonderful, and she was a beautiful, uh, very nice model. Uh, but unfortunately, there's only room for one model on this show, and that is me. And um, and uh, so she she's not going to be back uh, this week. We'll see about maybe she'll come back in the future. But for all of you who commented and said that you have to see Anna every single week, just hold your horses a little bit, and we'll we'll uh, we'll try to make as much as Anna possible as 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 we can. Now, I do want to say that there has been some interesting things happening this week. As you can see, Pete is dressed exactly like me, and this is a story that's difficult for me to tell, but I'm going to go ahead and tell it. I was asked by a major product review magazine to be on the cover, and they did a professional shoot with me, and I looked awesome. And Pete, um, we were snuggling one day and it slipped out that I had done this cover. And so Pete decided that he also had to cover, uh, had to have a cover. And so he went out and got his own cover. There is so much disappointment, Peter, about this, um, about the fact that you feel like you have to be me now. And I just don't appreciate any of that. Um, so I just want to let you know that you are a disappointment. People don't like you. Um, and if you weren't as attractive as you are, um, you wouldn't be here. It's not easy to rock the... the okay, okay, vibe. okay. You might notice that somebody keeps trying to talk, and this is the guest that we brought on this week. And it's an unfortunate um, situation because we couldn't get uh, Anna the model, so we have to uh, deal with the person that we did get. And, you know, it's kind of fun who we did get, and and, and I'll give him that. Uh, We uh, happened to meet him the other day. Peter and I were getting a car wash together, and we got stuck in the car wash, and someone was in the car behind us. And when we finally got out of the car wash, we walked out the door, and we had a very uh, funny chat together about how we were stuck in this car wash, and we couldn't believe it. It turns out he is a local rapper. And what I mean by that is he's local to the neighborhood, and he raps. And his name uh, is... um, uh, 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 Ram, uh, Ram, uh, Ram, uh, Ram, uh, Ram, Ram, Yeah, it's, it's Ramis. It's like, um, like if you, the, the word raw meat, you take the T off and put a Z on it. That's, that's how you say it. Okay, raw meat. Um, cool. So it is so exciting you're here. And you remember when we were talking the other day, you were saying, oh, this is so funny. I'm a local rapper. You do a product review show. I would love to come down on your show. Uh, you had said something about how you had seen multiple episodes of it and you were mm-hmm. a huge fan. I just want, I want you to product review my raps. Oh, I would love to do that. So you do, um, now can I just give a subject or a subject matter for you to rap about? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Cool. All right. Well, 
I, I won't necessarily rap about that, but you can give it, you can give it to me. Okay. Right. Okay. Ramit. Um, so Ramit, I want you to rap about vacuums. They suck. Help me pick the peanuts up that I left on the carpet. Vacuums tend to spark shit or start shit. Vacuums you can plug in. They drink electricity like it was juice and gin. Ride the ocean like a fin. No sharks don't swim. But if they stop, they drown. I'm the illest MC pound for pound. Here, swish your Hoover around. I mean your Hoover. I mean your Rover. What are those little things that run around without a motor? Or they do have a motor, but no one seems to guide them. It's like something is going on inside them. Roomba, that's what it is. I'm sorry, man. My brain's acting like I got seven kids. Actually, I don't. I have ten. They're all my little vacuum cleaner friends. They live in my closet. Drink electricity out the outlet like, like it was water from a faucet. All right, I'm done. <clears throat> cool. Uh, so that was a local rapper. If you ever wondered what the difference between a national rapper and a local rapper is, now you know. That was a local rapper performance, Raw Meat. And Raw, uh, raw Meat, um, thank you so much for that. And, and we're so glad to have you down to help review uh, our products today. Um, now, about the product we have, and this is pretty exciting. I was watching this reality show the other day, and it was that show that we love where they have the homeless people on, and then the other people smell them and try to determine how homeless they are. They are based on their smell. You know that show? And it is my favorite show. And I was thinking, you know what's coming up? Black Friday. And I always thought to myself, you know why Black Friday is fun? It's because it's the one time of year where you can really uh, buy cheap products um, that are uh, specifically the color black. At least that's my understanding of it. And so today we found a, 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 a product that is black that can be bought on Black Friday um, at a discount. And we are super excited about it. So, uh, 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 um, Pete. I got, I got these in this on last Black Friday. I'm sorry. No, you're right. This is the uh, 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 the goat uh, goat uh, sto uh, story a uh, uh, goat <laughs> goat mug and I and I didn't know that you could actually have a mug um, that was named after a goat and I'm not even sure why it is but it's black and what a cool thing to review for Black Friday it's like a horn because that's no that's why it's because I go because goats have horns. Or you could have goat milk in it. You could put goat milk in it. Um. Maybe let me do my show, oh, okay, right. you ho? Yeah. That's a state level rapper that I just did. Okay. So I'm going to do an, an unboxing for this while Rami shuts up so that I can finish doing my uh, product review. And this is super cool. It comes with um, some sort of a clip because everyone needs a clip when they're drinking uh, their coffee. And it's fully black and we love that part of it. And uh, according to raw meat, this looks like a uh, um, uh, something that the Vikings would use uh, to herd uh, the goats. And I thought that was such a. No, I meant goats have horns, but that actually that doesn't look. That looks more like a, like a cow's horn, or like a, a bull's horn. Right, it's bigger. <sighs> so I was wrong I'm the first the first time. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. You're very. Okay, Rami, thank you. So, <laughs> this is, it looks like a goat horn, and it is super cool because it's made out of leather, which is almost like a goat, so you're almost drinking something out of the thing that it was made of, and I think that's such an interestingly ironic thing to do with a product. And it has a super cool uh, top that you can seal, uh, seal it down, and it looks like, and I'm not sure, but let's take a look, raw meat. And it is, it's vacuum sealed. And I know that's something that we all love with coffee because it keeps things warm. And I love... Do we, each, do we each get one of these? 
because that's kind of you can't you can't stand it anywhere. <laughs> Man, I, I, I was I was nearby, you know. So this, uh, and I just want to say this, and I want to say this in the nicest way. This is why when you're at a car wash, stuck in the car wash, you don't invite the person who's also stuck in the car wash to come on to your product review show. To be fair, you were in there for like 20 minutes. Anyway, this is a super cool product. I'm really excited about it. If you enjoyed the show today, please smash that subscribe button. Lord knows we need more subscribers because if we don't get any, we're going to be stuck bringing local rappers like Raw Meat on the show, and I'm sure that's not what you want to see. Let's say if we get to 1,000 subscribers, we'll invite Anna the Model back on the show, but that's only if we get to 1,000 subscribers, which we probably won't do because I have no luck and nobody likes me. I'm going to go ahead and take the rest of the week off because it is Thanksgiving week, and I certainly deserve to eat a little bit of turkey uh pete you don't because you do nothing and you just copy everything i do and raw meat i am not sure this was a good appearance but i just want to thank you before you say something else because lord knows you're gonna say something else i just want to thank you for being on this show i am going to go i am going to go ahead and see you next monday got to be with your friends for life the dog is scout he's got a couple gross that are sticking out of his mangy fur. I don't mean to... Nah, I don't have it. Um, I don't have it. I'm really uncomfortable right now.